Ruth here, and this is my Crafters Companion haul number 21. And I've got one, two, three, four items. So one of them is a bundle of four, I think. Anyway, first up, let's see something small. Aha! This is a pretty, a pretty pink one. This is called a Call Lily Butter Girl. So this is the. Uh, yeah, whatever. It's from one of the more recent collections. Um, $2.99. So I did not wait for that to go on sale. Alright, so I kind of want to just, you know, collect them since I've got all of them so far. Okay, so... Yes. There are... Two ink pads. So first up we have a new... Do it in pad, which looks a bit scuzzy, but hopefully that's oh, fine. Is there a lighting fine over right here? Do I need to put the light on? Does that make a difference at all? Hmm. Oh, the pads are moving. Oh, it's cool. But anyway, this one is the Duet Ink Pad, Hummingbird. And it's $5.99. This also at $5.99 is the Spectre Noir Shimmer Pearl Ink Pad, Island Shore. I'll open them up in a minute. And last but not least is the collection of four. This is coming at 33 pounds. So first up, we have the Spectrum Noir Sparkle Glitter Brush Pens. This is the Earthy Natural Set of three. And coming at Hollywood, Smoke, Quartz, and Harvest Moon. Next up, we have the Antique Vintage set. I think that's, that's the set, right? Yes, same place. This is the Fig, Peacock Blue, and Macaroon. So purple, turquoise, and pink. This is green, kind of brown, maybe, and orange. Next up, we have Essential Brights, which is a very light blue, and like a magenta kind of color. There's another brand of pink, and a yellow. So it is. Aquamarine, Pink Garnet, and Firefly. And last, but not by no means least, is the Tint and Tone set. It's very pretty. This is the Clear Crystal, Starry Sky, and Onyx Black. So, like silver, blue, and black, basically. Like a Nice blue, not aquamarine or whatever that was. Maybe that was aquamarine. What was this one? Peacock blue. Yeah, not on the lighter blues, but it's more of the darker, kind of yellowish blue kind of color. But yes, those. I couldn't resist. I like the sparkle, you know? So, like, add some accents onto your picture and color or just on something. They had sparkle. That's the word sparkle brush glitter brush pens. So from what I gathered from the tutorial-ish thing, you open it up, you take away the band, you shake, and you dab until the ink goes downwards, like a normal paint pen kind of thing. And go. No, from what I can tell it gets real juicy or something, so you might have to Put some off to the side so you don't splodge your picture or whatever. 
But yes, that is beautiful. Oh, that makes a nice picture. Like the glitter one, it's tasty. Oh yes, but I was going to take these off. Okay, so I'm going to do an ink pad. It was on there, but... Yeah. Okay. Very nice. And then for the shimmering pad. I shall, uh... Swatch it in my other book. Not on here. I don't, know if I, I don't think I actually did a swatching video. I just did it when I was in bed. Um, and I could, I guess. Is it wrong? Hmm. You know what? Let's see if I can just quickly reach over. I put it in a uh, newly acquired four drawer uh, storage unit. So I put all my ink on the top row. And I've got my book on the side. But I do my swatches in. So let's do this without it falling off. Okay. I wasn't sure what else to use this book for. <laughs> so I just this is a freebie here from the Nintendo site. Club Nintendo reward thing. So I've got all my, my sketch off of markers. You know. Of course I did that before I wised up and put something underneath so it wouldn't go through on the other page. But like then the ink pads. There's two. Okay, do it ink pad. Do that one? So hummingbird. Let me get my pen over here. Now I have it in a very nice place. I'm just write it quickly over here. That's what that looks like. I guess it's kind of a little bit similar to Sailor's Awake. A little bit more green tinged, I guess. And then for fluorescent shimmer silver. Not pretty. Okay, so this is Island Shore. You can tell I used a different pen, but anywho. I just want to knock into the glitter glue so I don't have to bounce again. Uh, so That's a very pretty one, isn't it? It's very... Very light. Well, you can see that at all? I have no clue, because I'm at the wrong angle. I'm looking at my... ...thing. There's my... ...current... Whoops, I got it on my... Oh my god, glittery fingers. My little camera can stand here is a bit on the top side. A bit higher than my eye line. So anyway, that's my um you know. Then I got the um, gold in pads. That's 
champagne series one, which only has one sunbeam in it. Those ones. The Enchanted Ocean Tricolor Aqua Brush Pens. Color Bloom. I haven't quite did that justice on this swatch, but I do have some letter sort of thing. I think that was it for now. Yeah, those are all the swatches for now. I'll have to swatch these, maybe. I haven't actually gotten around to whether I should swatch my glitter glues or not. I haven't decided yet. But if I do, it'll probably be in here too. Because I do have pens and pads in here. I'll make, make it colorful. I probably could have separated them out a bit more because I don't have, have more do it in pads to put in, or I don't have enough space in that one shape. Anyway, that's off on a tangent. I only had like technically four items, because that counts as one. And it's almost, well, four minutes ish now. Anyways, thank you for watching. Over and out.